Watch out for these trucking scams, part three. The sign-on bonus. Now, the sign-on bonus in and of itself is not a scam, but some companies will take this a little bit too far. I've seen a couple of companies offer $10,000 sign-on bonus. To me, that is extremely exorbitant. Well, she has uh one more, one more trucking scams, part three. Watch out for these trucking scams, part three. The sign-on bonus. Now, the sign-on bonus in and of itself is not a scam, but some companies will take this a little. Stop. Sign-on bonus is a scam. Okay. Now, I'll give you. I'll give you. I, I'll, give you I, I'll give you a ding for that. Hold on, right quick. Yeah, I give you a ding for that one because <laughs> sign on bonus is bullshit. Sign on yes, bonus, sign on bonus is garbage. But let's hear what you have to say about it. Too far. I've seen a couple of companies offer ten thousand dollars sign on bonus. To me, that is extremely exorbitant. I really don't know of a lot of companies that would give that kind of money away to a driver. Um, so to me, it's more of a red flag. Now, there are some top tier companies that do offer bonuses like that. I know of one company that will offer an $8,000 bonus. Another one will uh, offer a $7,500 bonus. Those bonuses are legitimate. However, those bonuses are not legitimate either. No. Now, it's going to take you five years to get them $8,000. U.S. Express. Let's throw that out there. Is the one company that was offering $10,000 at one point, I'm not sure if they still offering it. And I'm and I'm thinking they was only offering that to teens. So right. it's five five thousand dollars per person. Mm -hmm. But that was the that was the only company. Now there's other companies that was that was offering, like she said, seven, eight thousand dollar bonuses, but it's gonna take you forever to get that bonus. Or to get that money. And what it is, what it is, it's an incentive bonus. Take mm -hmm. J and R. Swoogle, for example. Mm. I was brought on at $2,500 uh, sign-on bonus. And throughout the two years of my time with them, that's when it was paid out. I was getting, and in order to get paid out, of that twenty five hundred, I would have to hit like a certain, uh, I want to say milestone, but there's another word. Um, right there, you know, I would have to hit a certain thing as far as miles go, uh, keeping the idle down on the truck, or or how much fuel I put safety in the truck, and all that stuff. safety, yeah, yeah safety, mm -hmm. uh, and all like that. That's that's the way to get the sign or the quote unquote sign on bonus me i call it an incentive because it's only paid it's only paid and let me put this it's paid on the times when you don't have a good paycheck now when i was working for jct they had a two thousand dollar sign on bonus that they gave you 30 days apart mm. well my current company my current company gave uh gave gave me uh gave me the the sign on bonus and this was the actual sign on bonus because I got right. I, I got the I got the first I got the I got both I got 500 one check and the 500 the next check so right. yeah that's the sign when you sign on that's when you get the bonus right now at, now is it a, is it a scam yeah I, I'll give you that one let's mm -hmm. let's hear what else she has to say any of the companies that I'm speaking of in this video, they will use that sign-on bonus as, I guess, lingering meat over the driver. You know, like like a hungry animal that is, is hungry and you're just waving steak in their face. Many of these companies don't even intend to pay you the bonus. What they'll do is they'll offer you this exorbitant bonus and say, if you come drive for us, we'll pay you $10,000. That should be an automatic red flag. Then they will take that bonus and then turn it into a safety bonus. Then they'll turn it into a fuel bonus. Okay. Um, many times they might give you a little bit of it, and then they'll take it and stretch it out over time, sometimes a year, sometimes mm -hmm. more than that. Okay. And mm -hmm. then sometimes they will even do things like make that bonus contingent upon your having a good record. So a good record. Now, I got to admit, I got to admit, yeah. she, she's on point with this. 
Yeah. She's on point with this one. Okay, I had to get... Oh, hold on. She's on point with this. Hey. Hey. Ho. Hey. You you on point with this one, man, because that's what that's what these companies do. They use that... Yeah. They use that sign on that quote unquote sign on bonus because they know that you're going to come in and you don't have you, you're not going to have no money or anything like that. So they they hold that over you for each paycheck or oh, well, you get one hundred and fifty dollars, you get two hundred dollars, you get this, you get that. So, yeah, you 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 on point with this one. OK, OK. Or to them would be no fender benders, no late loads, no issues with your truck that they consider, you know, you could have prevented, that is a scam. Okay. It, it should not happen. Many times drivers will stay a long time just w w in hopes that they can get this bonus. And to me, a lot of companies will use this as a method of retention. Now, I have to also play devil's advocate because I can why? understand why some companies don't give you all of the money up front. Why? Keep in mind, there are drivers who will apply to a company just for the sign-on bonus. Once mm -hmm. they get the money from orientation, they quit. See, that's you, true. This is what you need to do, uh, most hated. This is <laughs> this is the kind of content that you need to do. You know, you don't don't try to play FMCSA police. All right, don't don't do that no more. That's not you. That's that's not you. Dry snitching doesn't fit you. All right, right. it doesn't fit you. And I, I'm I'm giving you your praise, most hated. I'm giving you your praise. You know, the, the first the first two, you know, the first two, we don't agree. Me and Zippor, we don't agree with that. No. But, but this one, but this one, you you hitting all cylinders with this one, because on the flip side, like you said, you know, wonder why companies don't pay the quote unquote sign on bonus. Oh, yeah. Right. Sign on bonus is a scam. Yeah, it is red flags. Yeah. You know, when when they when when the recruiter tell you, oh, well, we got a five, six, seven, eight. Well, why? Let me ask you this. See, this is what you guys need to ask. Don't ask about the sign on bonus, because if they tell they they're gonna tell you anyway. So don't ask about the sign on bonus. They they're gonna be happy to tell you, oh, well, we got a a, a five thousand, six thousand, seven thousand dollar sign on bonus. Oh, uh -huh. you, oh, you do? Um why is this so high? Right. That's what you need to ask. How what? long is it going to be before it's paid out? How? Yeah, that. Ask that. How long is going to be? Why? How long is going to be to be paid out? And why is your sign-on bonus is so high? See, that should be a red flag because if the sign on bonus so high, then maybe it's not even really a good company to start with. Exactly. Because they can't get nobody to stay. obviously, it, thank you, Zippor. Obviously, they can't get nobody to stay. There you right. go. And that's why they, 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 they offering five, six, seven, eight hundred. I mean, eight, eight hundred. God damn. Eight thousand. Yeah, but if they paying it out over a year or two, they still ain't going to stay. Mm. You got a point there. You got a point there. So they, the company's still losing. They yeah. still gonna lose in the end. Well, those are the three trucking scams from our favorite TikToker, the most hated. <laughs> so definitely go and uh go and give her a follow. You know, she's up to fifty five hundred uh followers. Uh, the one. The one that me and and Zippor, we probably have another issue on is the one I can't find it. I, I can't find it, but it's the one where she was talking about not giving out your information as a yeah. female truck driver or something like that. But yeah. I, I have an issue because of the fact that you when you snitched, dry snitched. Right. Or even if you know, even if you didn't know that you were snitching, you put your information out there, your names out there, and your faces out there. So, I she got comments saying she knew she was snitching. <laughs> she got comments saying. Oh, shout out to you know, shout out to my followers that still send me your videos. 
I'm just saying. I'm surprised she didn't block me because when she made the video about being the streak about where you are, I commented, and this is coming from a person that snitched on somebody and got them fired. Watch out for these trucking scams, part three. The sign-on bonus. Now, the sign-on bonus in and of itself is not a scam, but some companies will take this a little bit too far. I've seen a couple of companies offer $10,000 sign-on bonus. To me, that is extremely exorbitant.